Hey guys, Kent with EMS Blood Consultants here. Today I've got the Q and Flow Warrior Light Blood Warmer. This is a great warmer for transfusing blood in the field. It's got great battery life. You can see it's got a removable battery here. Um, this one battery will last you at least four units of blood. Um, and then all the heating takes place in this uh, black styrofoam block here. This is the disposable part. It's got a stainless steel coil in there that the IV tubing runs through. Um, and it actually can heat up to 200 mLs per minute as far as the flow rate. So if you need to get blood in quick, this is the unit to go with. Um, so pretty simple setup here. Just plug the block in. There's only one way it can go. We call that firefighter proof. And it automatically turns on. It's already starting to heat up. All right, so I've got my blood tubing here. You can use any uh, blood tubing. So you wanna make sure that it has a filter in it and a Y set. So we're gonna start with saline. I'm just gonna hook that up. This end here will go to my patient. So we'll say my partner's starting that line for me like a good partner. Getting a saline lock on. We're gonna go ahead and fill the strip chamber up about halfway. And we're gonna let that guy start flowing. All right, so once we got that flushed, we're gonna check our IV, make sure it's patent. And then I'm gonna go ahead and hook up my blood. I'm gonna shut off my saline, transfer over to the blood, and we can see it change in the drip chamber there. And that's pretty much it. We are ready to flow blood. Again, this is the Q and Flow Warrior Light. If you have any questions about starting a whole blood program at your EMS agency, give me a shout at emsblood.com.